Hey, welcome to another video by DJSPRC. Today we have the Irma infraction in the house. Let's take a look around it. I did shoot another video today uh, with physically no sound, or should I say music? But I wanted to bring it in and take a closer look and it, talk about it a bit. It's a great looking truck. Seriously, uh, Arma basically right now are attacking Traxxas solid. Because this vehicle has a lot of resemblance to the X01. Let's take the cab out, or off should I say, and let, let's look inside. They even put uh, reinforcers mirror if you do flip it to prevent uh, basically scratching your body. A lot of sense, a lot of sense. And the inside of the body is pretty much normal. Let's put the body here. Seventeen mil X's. Aluminum chassis. Twin battery to run 22 volts. It has the new IC5 from Spectrum. It has a new brace to stiffen up the chassis. And big bore shocks. All aluminum. Some kind of a, a big plastic front bumper here that seems to be very solid. We do have the rear diffuser. Like the X01. Not sure if she's gonna want to focus. There we go. But seriously, very great vehicle. Like I said, aluminum chassis. And here you see a little bit better the diffuser. And even the tires are extremely sticky. Seriously. Metal gear servo. All waterproof. Server, yeah. I like it. Still center drive shafts and front center drive shaft. A shaft, but the uh, see, these are dog bones. Yeah, they are. Pretty much what you can expect from Arma and the other vehicles they have, like the new Typhoon, the new Creighton. They all have the center bar. And what's fun about it, if you have the older version, you can basically buy these parts and adapt yours to it. That's one thing Arma did that I really like. Vehicle is uh, rated to 80 plus miles an hour. On 22.2 volts, 4x4, four four, with the AVC of Spectrum. AVC is basically a stability to keep the vehicle pretty much straight.
Now, while filming this, this vehicle is not ready to be bought. It's just out to the local hobby shops for demonstration purposes. I just love what they did with the uh, back diffuser here. To reinforce it because this thing is going to lift up from the front end and scrape the bottom here. It has the newest BLX system in it. They're pretty much proven bulletproof. Great job, Arma. Now, if you guys even have any questions or comments, post down below. I'll be glad to answer you guys. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up if you did like this video. And if you want to be notified the next time I upload another video, hit the uh, bell icon to be notified. The Arma Infraction Street Basher.